Hey everyone, this is Mega Cassandra. Welcome to my YouTube channel where I explore the calming power of beautiful watercolors. You'll find me mostly outside painting leaves or in here exploring the joyous and wonderful world of watercolors and exploring its calming and relaxing powers. Subscribe to my channel to join me in this journey. This is what we are going to paint today. So I just took a lemon from the fridge and I'm gonna use only yellows to paint this lemon and this is a really fun exercise to you know observe something and see something and then just paint it. So don't stress yourself up. You might get the shape a little bit here and there. This is just a fun practice that you have that you can try doing for yourself if you find it difficult to do it freehand you can always go ahead and draw it very very lightly with the pencil first so all i'm doing is looking at the lemon and then just observing it so the angle is a little bit different for me as i'm sitting on the side and the camera is on the top so i'm gonna paint what i am seeing so for that i will apply this darker yellow and if you want the specific shades uh, what I'm using the specific colors then you can find that in the description also there are a few a few links to a few resources and also some classes so don't forget to check that out in the description and I'm gonna I'm gonna try a lot of things in here like uh, white space leaving white space wet on wet uh, our first step that I did was wet on dry and next will be wet on wet a lot of lifting will also be there and you can try this exercise with any of the fruits like kiwi or orange or anything like that and even blueberries the small berries cherries anything just observe what you see you don't have to get it right in the first go just observe and then just paint take your brush and paint try to try to see what all colors do you see so for this lemon i really wanted to stick to the yellows so there's there's lemon yellow there's ochre yellow and and the hansa yellow so so many yellows are here and that's what i'm going to use and most important is the white space for the highlights i'm not going to use any highlighter so i will just leave the white space and as you can see i'm starting with very very simple geometric shapes and this is not a sped up video this is just real time and i was able to uh, paint this under 10 minutes so painting doesn't have to be really complicated or you don't need a lot of preparation like whenever you feel like go in your kitchen find a tomato find any veggie that is in there and just try to paint it up and now the all the highlights the sh shadows i'm gonna get with the ochre yellow so i'm going to use a lot of ochre yellow for the inside part
so wherever you feel like you have added too much paint you just lift it off with your brush which is the lifting technique for watercolors and then just wipe your brush clean your brush and repeat it until you get the white nice white paper for the highlights you try to take more pigment on your brush and try to get little more precise and more detailed strokes more thin strokes so you can also use a um, smaller brush i am using i'm not going to use any smaller brush because the brush has a nice tip so i will be adding the highlights with this brush only So that's about it. I think I for me it looks quite good now and I'm just going to stop. You can always add a background if you want. You can add some shadows if you want. So for me I'm just done here and so I'll just stop here. I hope you like the tutorial. Do give it a try and share it with me and I will see you next Friday. Till then thank you and bye-bye and happy painting.